And I'll tell you, when you think of the cooler temperatures at the end of August and the beginning of September, mm -hmm. you think of high school football season, which kicked off last Friday, which feels awesome. But it is this Friday that the Lake High School Flyers have really been waiting all summer. It's been a tough summer for that district. Yeah, they're ready to play their first game on the rebuilt field. And starting today, you can get tickets to the game. Ryan Vetter is live at the Temporary Lake High School on Tracy Road in Northwood with the details. Hello, Ryan. This is a very exciting event, of course. Have you got your tickets yet? I have not got my tickets yet. They don't go on, they're not on sale right now. Uh, I do want to make one slight correction. We are actually at the original Lake High School because we are at the football field. Now, I want to tell you something. If you, a, a few months ago, if you would have looked at this field, you would have said there's no way that they're playing football this year on this field. But look, take a look at this field. The field is beautiful. They're putting the finishing touches on the visitor stands, and we really have to get those finished because this is going to be a packed house. We're going to talk to Jody right here. Uh, tickets are going on sale today for what, what I've been calling one of the hottest tickets in town, right? That is correct. Tickets go on sale tonight, 6 to 7.30 at Lake Elementary. All right, and they can pick them up tonight and tomorrow? They can pick them up tonight and tomorrow. All right, and they're $6. And it's Lake, the football field is right behind the elementary, so if you take west that way, that's where the uh, elementary school actually is. And you also have something else coming up, um, the night of the game here. Yes, we have a spaghetti dinner that will take place from 4 until 6 p.m. at Lake Elementary as well. And tickets are also $6 for adults, $4 for students. So it's dinner and entertainment all in one. All in one right here. Now, how excited are you guys to actually get back on the field um, after all the devastation from June? This is amazing. Even, like you said, looking around here, it's so uplifting to see our home, our home getting back to where it was. It, it looks gorgeous. I'm, I'm just excited to bring our students out here so that they can see this as well. And we were talking off camera how amazing it is how football will bring a community together. It is amazing. I mean, football does. It makes a lot of decisions, and this is a good one. This is a good one for our students. I think that our students need this. This is going to be a good, uplifting night, so I'm excited for Friday. Now, there is a big special ceremony going on between at 6.30, correct? And, and what's involved in that? Yes, we have a dedication ceremony starting at 6.30 on Friday. Um, we're going to, you know, turn our football community, our football stadium over to the community. Instead of Flyer Stadium, we're going to name it Lake Community Stadium. So we're excited to do that. All right. Thanks, Jody. And, and again, it's Friday night. Tickets go on sale uh, today and tomorrow right out here at uh, Lake Elementary School. And I'll let you in on a little tiny secret. You can actually go by the hangar and you might be able to pick up a ticket there. We don't want to bombard them there. So if you can come out here to Lake Elementary, uh, pick them up here. $6 for adults, $4 for children. Don't forget spaghetti dinner from 4 to 6 before. So you can have mm -hmm. dinner and entertainment. Plus, obviously, we're going to be broadcasting live from 5 to 7 out here. It's going to be a big deal. You're going to want to come out early, find your parking, and uh, enjoy the, the ceremony. You know, it's going to be a little somber. But a little bit of excitement out here because things are kind of getting back to normal. You know, you can still see behind me the the part of the high school that, that's still standing that, that has, was dev devastated in June. But, uh, you know, we're trying to get past that out here. And it uh, should be a good night. Football, excitement, new field. Be a good time, guys. All right. Thank you so much, Ryan. Yeah, that absolutely. And I like the positive aspect of that, too. Looking at that new field, it just looks fantastic. It's in great shape. And they're going to be very, ready to play some football. Cool. Looking forward to that.